are you today? I'm doing pretty fantastic, thank you for asking. Now as a person who thrives on the internet, who is always on the internet, I naturally sometimes go to Facebook. Every single time, I regret it. I wrote down a list of all the reasons why I hate Facebook. You know, the more I go on Facebook, the more aggravating it gets because it's just so irritating. For your entertainment, I came up with a bunch of reasons of why I hate Facebook. One of the reasons why I hate Facebook is the repeated ship post DIYs on how to make a paper boat. I don't need cutesy little pop music in the background with little flowers being put on the paper boat. Just Google it. Or I don't need a DIY on how to make a stool out of a tree stump. You know what it is? It's a tree stump with flowers stapled to it. A second reason as to why I hate Facebook is the amount of politics that goes on on my Facebook feed. Like that's great that you have views, but I don't need 15 posts about how bad Donald Trump is and how amazing Bernie Sanders is. Like I can make my own decision. This stuff, I don't need it. I can look up my own stuff. I know Donald Trump is bad. I already know this. Everyone knows it. it's a joke. I don't need 15 posts about it in the span of 30 minutes. My third reason as to why I hate Facebook. Why is everybody married? Why is everyone popping out babies? Like, I don't need to know that your child just took his first poop. I don't need to know that. Another reason why I hate Facebook is because there's always that one person that posts something literally every 10 minutes. Every 10 minutes, just stop. Stop. Whether it's a status or a selfie or a video you're sharing or a how-to that you made or your YouTube video. Get away from your computer screen for at least 30 minutes and maybe instead of sharing a video of little kids giving flowers to charity, maybe you should go give flowers to charity. How about actually doing that? The fifth reason why I hate Facebook is because of those scams that people do. You know what I'm talking about, like the wraps or the diet pills. Do people fall for that? Like no, no one's gonna buy your $200 seaweed wrap that's supposed to make all of your cellulite disappear off your body when you're like 300 pounds. That's not how, that's not how any of this works. The sixth reason why I hate Facebook is because of the whiners. You'd think at 25 they would be done because it's a 15 year old thing to do, but no, 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 they are not done. Oh, today was so awful. Why? What's wrong, girl? I'm here for you if you need me. <laughs> oh my God, I don't want to talk about it. The seventh reason as to why I hate Facebook is because of the overly zealous people. Whether it's over religion, or politics, or veganism, it's gotta be overly done. Like, I'm glad that you have something you were so passionate about. But seriously, because I drink milk from a cow, I should be tied up and milked for the rest of my life as a machine. Apparently, if you're not Christian, you are Satan. Apparently, if you don't have the same political views as the person you're arguing with, you're a moron. The eighth reason why I hate Facebook is because of all the clickbait ads that pop up on my timeline. Just every few sec, every few seconds, it just pops up. Hey, do this. Hey, do that. And it is even worse when it's the quizzes, the clickbait pop-up quizzes, and you're like, oh. Okay, and it says like so-and-so liked this. And then you find out that this person actually took the quiz and turns out their conscience is the color purple. And turns out the angel on their shoulder is four feet tall, somehow stands on her shoulder and her favorite color is pink. And she loves rainbows. And guess what? That means you're a good person. And the devil on your shoulder is apparently three years old and doesn't know what he's talking about. So you're automatically a good person. You have no idea what's going on in life, ever. The ninth reason why I hate Facebook is all the lovey-dovey couples that just feel the urge to post everything on Facebook. No, no one wants to know that you and your boyfriend just made out for three hours. No one wants to see a picture of your boyfriend grabbing your boob. No one wants to see a picture of your girlfriend grabbing your crotch. The 10th reason why I hate Facebook is because of the people that only update with selfies. I'm hot, look. I'm hot. I'm so hot. Hot, hot, so hot. Hot AF. Those are all the reasons why I hate Facebook. If you guys can think of any more, please feel free to leave it down in the comments below. I would love to hear your Facebook stories. I know people are gonna be like, well, okay, why don't you just delete your Facebook? I would, but unfortunately, if I do, my mom's gonna think I've been kidnapped and probably sold into sex slavery. Thank you for liking the video. Thank you for subscribing to the channel, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Hope you have fantastic day. Goodbye.